you know, uh, we always think of, of models, and uh, teachers will often use something like uh, the beads. So you know the little Mardi Gras beads that are here? Mm -hmm. This is just a really long strand of beads, about 100 feet long. And uh, and you can talk about molecules using these beads. So the, the kind of, uh, the, the little bead that you see there, one hook to the next to the next, is kind of the definition in simple terms of a polymer, okay. or just a long chain of molecules. So this is kind of cool. These are called Newton's beads. And so if I hold them up like this, right. uh, Newton says that an object will stay in motion and move in that same direction direction and same speed until a force acts upon it. So if I throw it up in the air, all of a sudden gravity is going to take over and kind of start to pull it down. And when it pulls it down, it's going to start to speed up. So here, watch this. Uh, yeah. you, you hang on to this. Okay. Ready? Okay. So watch this. As it starts to kind of pull up and over, watch this. It literally oh, wow. will just kind of pull itself out. And so as it keeps on going down, going down, going down, and if I even raise it higher, see yeah. how it gets faster and faster That's with free crazy. fall. See how it kind of, it, it just keeps the kids busy for hours. Because then they have to put it all back into the container, which is a nice thing to do because you can't just either. pick it up and do that. You have to kind of slowly put it in like this and like this. All right, so how do we put it into uh, to real world use? Right. This is a material called polyethylene oxide that firefighters used to use years ago, and they would use just a tiny little bit of it to kind of help the water flow a little bit faster oh, in wow. that uh, in the uh, the hose. So this uh, in a tremendously long molecule. It has a molecular weight of about four million. But look at how it just siphons itself out of the container. So it's this self-siphoning gel. How Is that long really cool? exactly? I mean, I know you said the weight, but... Oh, yeah. It's, uh, so if they take it, they say, the estimate, they take it and they stretch that molecule out, it'll go from here to the moon and back twice. Are you kidding and me? It's just absolutely amazing. So it's this long strand of molecules. And look at this. Just like the beads, it'll start to pull itself out. Right. The, the hard part is trying to throw it away because if you get a tiny little bit over the edge of the trash can or something, oh. it'll siphon itself back out again, which seems to be another problem in the Spangler household. But that's kind of oh, how no. that whole thing works. Is that fun? <laughs> That's so we're, so we cool. combine a little bit of chemistry and some physics, and the Newton's bead thing is really fun because it literally will just take off super, super fast. Right. What a great way to be able to show it. So again, this one here, that long chain of molecules, right. uh, it starts in motion and then kind of pulls off, and it just kind of, it just great, just kind of goes, goes and goes and goes, and it's, um, well, it's gone. It's so gone. that's uh, <laughs> now we get to clean the whole thing up. And, Thank you. Steve. Fun. Put the information on the website, and there's always just a lot of stuff on there. So that if you're looking for some fun things to do in the summer, there's always something.